Hi again, Alex here with part 2 of my creating custom animation video tutorials. My first video explains the procedure in detail, especially how to export and import animation clips from the game. This second video focuses on a simpler method to create animations with the IK chains removed. This means that you can animate the legs in milk shape using the traditional method by moving the various leg joints such as BR calf, which is the right calf. Any animation you create will be played in the game correctly without you having to mess with the IK joints. Basically what you see in milk shape is what you'll see in the game. Use the B root bind to move a sim up or down, or to rotate him in various planes. First, download the Jazz Utility Package file which is in the link provided. This is a one frame animation clip file with the arcade chains already removed. Open this file with S3PE and export and rename it. For example, A underscore animation 2. Don't forget to always use the A underscore as a prefix for naming your animations. Use Wes Howe's Anim tool to convert the clip to an SMD file. Locate the rig file you downloaded with Mesh's adult body mesh when prompted. You should receive no errors. Open Milkshape, then open the body mesh file which has an MS3D extension. Ignore any errors you may receive and click OK. Import the SMD into Milkshape. And click on Animation Mode. There is no need to delete the keyframes using this method. Since this is a one frame animation, you'll need to add more frames. Add the number of frames you want to the total frames, for example 200. Make sure max frame is set to the same value. Create your animation as usual, remembering to set keyframes once each animation frame is finished. See my previous video tutorial which explains this in more detail. Once you're satisfied with the animation, save the file in Milkshape. Saving your file enables you to edit it at another time and refine it. Click out of animation mode and export the file as an SMD sequence. Overwrite the SMD you use to import into Milkshake. I often export and rename about 10 files from Jazz Utility and convert them to SMD. I then have a supply of reserve SMDs to use. You can even modify the animation in Milkshake and export to any of the reserve SMDs without having to import that specific SMD first. This is especially useful if you wish to make slight modifications to similar animations. Simply tweak your animation in Milkshake, save it with a new name, 
Then export as an SMD sequence, overriding one of your reserve SMDs. For example, A underscore animation 3. Once done, open Anim tool and convert the SMD back to a clip file. Open S3PE and create a new package. Import the clip file. Click OK, then save as a package file. Follow the instructions in the first video tutorial to install and trigger the animation in the game using CMO Money's Animation Player. To see examples, our movie The Priest as over 30 custom animations are created. Many of the animations created for that machinima are slight modifications of other animations I made. And that's all there is to it. Have fun!